Hey there, welcome back to the Genesis Cloud Agent Training Course. In this module, we will discuss performance and analytics. Let's get started. In this final module, we will walk through agent performance and get an understanding for the performance menu as well as review your performance view. Genesis Cloud Agent Performance is a measure of how well an agent is able to handle interactions with customers. This can be assessed by looking at a variety of metrics, such as Average Handle Time AHT is the average amount of time that an agent spends handling an interaction. This includes the time spent talking to the customer, as well as the time spent on after-call work, such as updating customer records or taking notes. First Call Resolution FCR is the percentage of interactions that are resolved on the first call. This is a measure of the agent's ability to resolve customer issues quickly and efficiently. Customer Satisfaction CSAT is a measure of how satisfied customers are with the service that they receive from the agent. This is typically measured using surveys or feedback forms. In addition to these quantitative metrics, Genesis Cloud also provides supervisors with a variety of tools to assess agent performance qualitatively. For example, supervisors can listen to call recordings, read chat transcripts, and review agent notes. This can help supervisors to identify areas where agents need improvement and to provide them with coaching and support. Genesis Cloud agent performance is important for a number of reasons. First, it can have a direct impact on the customer experience. Customers are more likely to be satisfied with their experience if they are able to get their issues resolved quickly and efficiently. Second, Agent performance can also impact the bottom line. A well-trained and efficient workforce can help companies to reduce costs and improve profitability. There are a number of things that Genesis Cloud agents can do to improve their performance, including Be knowledgeable about the company's products and services. The more knowledgeable an agent is, the better equipped they will be to answer customer questions and resolve customer issues. Be able to use Genesis Cloud features and tools effectively. Genesis Cloud provides a variety of features and tools that can help agents to be more efficient and effective in their work. Agents should take the time to learn how to use these features and tools effectively. Be able to communicate effectively. Agents should be able to communicate clearly and concisely with customers. They should also be able to listen carefully to customer concerns and needs. Be able to problem solve effectively. Agents should be able to think critically and identify solutions to customer problems. They should also be able to explain solutions to customers in a clear and concise manner. By following these tips, Genesis Cloud agents can improve their performance and provide a better customer experience. Genesis Cloud supervisors can also play a role in improving agent performance by providing regular coaching and support. Supervisors should meet with agents regularly to provide feedback on their performance and to offer coaching and support. Setting clear expectations. Supervisors should set clear expectations for agents in terms of their performance goals. This will help agents to know what is expected of them and to stay motivated. Providing opportunities for training and development. Supervisors should provide agents with opportunities to train and develop their skills. This will help agents to improve their performance and to become more valuable to the team. By taking these steps, Genesis Cloud Supervisors can help to create a high-performing team of agents who are able to provide excellent customer service. Next, let's take a look at the Performance menu. The Genesis Cloud Performance menu provides supervisors and agents with access to a variety of tools and reports that can be used to track and improve agent performance. Clicking on Performance, then Workspace will bring up the menu. As an agent, you will be given a few different options. The Employee Engagement section gives you the ability to see your development and scorecard. You should be familiar with these as we reviewed these in an earlier module. The My Performance section provides agents with access to their own performance data, such as their AHT FCR and CSAT scores. The other section provides you with which exports you have access to, which have been scheduled. Let's click on My Performance. Let's focus on the My Performance section. Under that, Click on My Performance. Agents can use the My Performance view to track their own progress and identify areas where they can improve. Clicking the plus icon will pop out a table where you can add various columns, all to help you get an understanding for how your performance is going in 30-minute increments. By either checking or unchecking boxes, it will add or remove the column to the main view. 
the performance view allows you to compare your performance to goals that have been set by supervisors. This can help you to identify areas where you are meeting or exceeding expectations, as well as areas where you need improvement. You can also use the filters to narrow down the data. The performance view allows you to filter the data by agent, team, queue, and date range. This can help you to focus on the data that is most relevant to you. Next, let's take a look at the MyQ activity. To see real-time statistics for all of the queues you are a member of, go to My Queues activity. This view displays current metrics and information about your queues, such as the number of waiting interactions, the number of current interactions, and the number of agents on queue. Customize the view with filters and column controls. Clicking the plus icon will pop out a table where you can add various columns, all to help you get an understanding for how your queue's performance is going. By either checking or unchecking boxes, it will add or remove the column to the main view. You can also use the filters to narrow down the data. When filtering, you can select more than one media type. Click the relevant media type to select or deselect the type. To recap, this module reviewed agent performance and how it assists the agent to monitor their performance. The performance menu gives agents access to a variety of tools and reports that can be used to track and improve agent performance. We also reviewed the My Performance view, which provides agents with access to their own performance data, such as their AHT FCR and CSAT scores. As with previous modules, this module has hands-on exercises, as well as a quiz to help you apply what was learned in this module. Thank you for completing Module 7. In Module 8, we will do a course review and next steps.